Okay, back on the move again, heading to the airport. Bye bye, bye bye. Bye bye. <laughs> bye, -bye. Off to Vietnam. Okay, so today we're flying from a different airport in Bangkok. This is called Don Muang or something like that. I think this is the older airport here in Bangkok. The other one was brand new and uh, very modern. <laughs> now we're in the airport here. Flying with the Air Asia today. So. Okay, today we're flying with Air Asia. Haven't tried that before. Yeah. New, new airline. Vietnam is looking like, but we don't know because we don't have been there already. But what do you think about that, Daddy? That's beautiful. On behalf of Air Asia, Captain Kitinan, First Officer Natawak, and our cabin crew would like to thank you for traveling with us today. It's welcome. Okay, we made it to Vietnam. We are now in uh, Ho Chi Minh City, otherwise known as uh, Saigon, it used to be known as. So everything went okay. We flew with Air Asia this time. It's quite a much cheaper flight than we've had other times, but everything worked okay. A little bit bumpy, but never mind. So we just cleared uh, immigration without any problems. And both uh, Danish and uh, British passports, they can uh, travel to Vietnam for 15 days without, without a visa. So just a simple stamp. So we should uh, be out of Vietnam again within 15 days. So that's no problem. So that was easy enough. Yes. So now we just uh, need to find a taxi. All yep. our bikes have arrived, luggage has arrived. The luggage so. is here, you can see it now. Daddy, let me tell you that. This yes. is the luggage and our bicycles are there. So, ready to go <laughs> in Vietnam. Okay, let's get going. Even the uh, temperature's not too bad here. It's not uh, it's quite nice and warm, but not uh, really hot or humid like before. So. No, not like uh, India and not like Thailand. A bit more fresh here. Fresh here. Yeah. More. Yeah. It'd be good for cycling in this weather. Yeah. So, yeah. Just wait for the taxi manager's gone to collect the car, then he'll take us to the hotel. So, let's see what the uh, Saigon looks like. Never seen so many motorcycles or scooters in one city before. <laughs> Just amazing. Okay, taxi just dropped us off here. <laughs> Our hotel's not far from here, we just have to walk backwards and forwards a few times. This is there to the backpacking area of uh, Saigon here. Just heard some Danish people actually go by. Okay, everyone, now we just come to Vietnam and we just arrived with our hotel. And what do you think about that? Yeah, that was a good uh, ride. Another modern city near the airport, but uh, we're in the backpacker district here. So um, there's a lot of life just outside the hotel here. and. Uh, Lots of scooters, I've never seen so many scooters before. So uh, yeah, interesting place. Let's uh, go and have a look outside now and uh, see if we can get something to eat, I think, and uh, 
have a look around. But uh, yeah, now we're in Vietnam. That's the end of all the flights and uh, yeah, cars and whatever we else we've been using. So now it's time just to get the bikes unpacked tomorrow, and then uh, not sure whether we stay. Maybe stay an extra night here, so we have time to have a look around. Um, two or three days. Three, no, three days maximum. Three days maximum. We booked for two, but we may stay three, so we have one day just to uh, have a look around and one day to unpack the bikes. So uh, that's it, and then we look forward to get cycling again. But, uh, yeah. So yeah, very good. So we're here. <laughs> this um, is the most uh, east we've been on the tour so far, and uh, we may not be getting more east than this because from here we're heading a little bit west again back to Bangkok. So. <laughs> And yeah, that was it. Okay. It's not far from our hotel here and there's a lot of live ones again, yeah? Never seen so many scooters before ever. <laughs> shopping centre just with food stalls. <laughs> Okay, so Jamie has finally found some food he likes. He's been struggling with uh, spicy food in India and Nepal, but now this food here is really tasted without being spicy. <laughs> it's the first time I've seen him finish his dinner for a long time. today the end of our final move with the bikes and airplanes so I think we may stay here tomorrow one extra day and then go and see some of the sites here tomorrow and then the day after we'll pack the bikes out of the boxes and then uh, get out of the noise and get into the countryside <laughs> some peace and quiet but that'll be nice but uh, our hotel's in a, a quiet alleyway here and, uh, only 100 meters from all the noise and <laughs> the bars but it looks pretty quiet where we are, so that's okay. So, okay. I think we need a rest now, and uh, we'll go and see a little bit of uh, the city here tomorrow. Okay, see you. I just picked up a new uh, Vietnamese 4G internet card. Must be the easiest one we've ever got. <laughs> Took uh, about three seconds. Just asked the guy in the reception, he gave me a card with 4G internet. Plus five dollars and it lasts one month. <laughs> Nothing to register at all. No passports, no pictures, no anything. Just pay the money, and get the card, work straight away. <laughs> oh dear, some things are easy in some countries. Okay, good night. <laughs>